and expect once again, especially from our senior athletes, you know, they haven't had much opportunities this year so far uh, in good, well-organized local competitions. So I think the seniors will, will grab this moment. And um, uh, in some of the, we've seen some of the throwing events, some big events, but especially the middle and long distance, we're going to see a few very, very good performances coming through. We're expecting around 12 uh, clubs to take part from all over Namibia. I think there are about 27 in total. Unfortunately for some of them, it's so far to travel, you know, and it's quite expensive and they just haven't got the money. So in short, the format of, of the Coca-Cola Club Championships with Marathon Sugar, our co-sponsor, and we would like to thank both of them, is that um, the format is we're going to take the 10 best performances from each club. Five from males, five from females, and coming from different events, middle distance, sprints, hurdles, jumps and throws. So we would like to force our our clubs to uh, to coach and to get coaches that can coach throughout the spectrum and address all the different events and disciplines that we find in athletics. Yes, uh, and I would like to say thank you once again, Coca-Cola and Marathon Sugar. They are sponsoring, you know, the week before the Nationals. Uh, we're going to conduct an officials course where we're going to qualify the officials and in this case teachers to be very good and qualified officials at the national championships. And that's the only way they can serve our children and the athletes properly if they've got the know-how. We appreciate their time and the effort that they put in. But they haven't got the tools to do it. They cannot do the job properly. So it's not only then qualified officials for the competitions, but going out and conducting training and coaching clinics where we give them the know-how and, uh, you know, make them at least try to make them qualified coaches that they can coach the different disciplines properly. And that will help, of course, the athlete to reach their full potential. And I think uh, it's a slow process, but it's uh, at the end, uh, we, we reap the fruits. And as we've heard now, you know, uh, more than 5,000 athletes that took part in the, in the regional championships, 950 invited for the nationals. And that's wonderful because it's an individual sport and it's not a team sport. So that makes it brilliant and great. So we're looking forward starting this coming Saturday, half past eight in the in the Independent Stadium, going through till twelve o'clock, and uh, well, uh, we're expecting a, a few very very good performances.